Around seven years back, when I was preparing for GATE, along with my roommate, we used to have really detailed discussion on complex topics in mechanical engineering like heat transfer, air conditioning, fluid mechanics, etc. And we will try to explain each other what we understood to a very simpler level. Once I got selected in GATE, instead of going for mechanical engineer, I went for CFD in aerospace department. Now there, I studied very complicated physics as well as mathematical techniques, but I completely lost touch from basic subjects from mechanical engineering. And one fine day, when I sat for placements for my company, which is core mechanical industry, I was able to crack its written as well as interview by remembering those concepts which I studied almost three years back. And do you know what is the interesting part? I still remember those basic concepts and apply in job to solve different projects. Now why I am telling you this story? Reason is simple, importance of understanding the concept to the deeper level rather than surface level. If you understand something to a fundamental level, you won't forget in your entire life. That is why learning with deeper understanding is important. And Einstein said, if you can't explain it simply, you don't understand it very well enough. That's the key principle of today's video. But we are not going to talk about Einstein today, but another famous scientist, Richard Feynman, he used a simple yet effective technique to learn anything, not only complex physics but also in learning new languages. Let's see now what is Feynman technique. The first step is explain the topic to someone else. As my friend and I used to discuss the different topics and explain it to each other, same way find a buddy and start discussing or rather explaining him what you understand. Think in much simpler term. If you understand it well, it means you are clear with the concept. Now you might have questions, what if I don't have someone to share my understanding? Don't worry, in this case you can pick anyone. This step works better when you are explaining to someone who is not familiar with the topic at all. You can start with your brother or sister or even your parents. And don't just use definitions in explanation, try to explain it with examples. That will be much simpler to explain. Second step is identify the points you can't explain in simple ideas. While explaining you will obviously find some complex concepts, technical terms. Now identify these terms and try to find the way to explain them or rather understand them in a simple way. Try to take help of your teacher or your friends or seniors to understand the concepts further more deeply. See this step is actual extra effort that you will put to understand complex problems in simple way. For starters, you can always search in YouTube about the topic to understand from visual perspective. Feynman explained complex atomic structure in simple way. His nickname was a great explainer. So try to challenge yourself at least a little bit to find a way to explain something in easier way. I am also trying to make a presentation for explaining how does CFD that is computational fluid dynamic works in layman term. Hopefully once I have done it, I will make a video on it. Third point is simple. Go back and study the weak point again. That means if you can't explain any point, you obviously didn't understood it easily. You just have to go back, study it again, probably from different resources and try to repeat the whole exercise. So final step is repeat the steps again for these weak points. The last tip I wanted to give is sleep properly. While you sleep, the information you stored in short term memory will get processed and get stored in long term memory. This tip is general, not particularly from Feynman technique. I hope you will apply this technique in future. This video I will make in Hindi as well in next week. If you like this information, please give us a thumbs up and share with your friends and family. If you are new to our channel, you can click here to subscribe and click the bell icon so that you never miss our latest update. Our engineering related videos usually comes on every Monday. Finally, thanks for watching.